okay? Electric Shepherds, 86. Chicho, any advice on trying to keep a hopeful outlook? The future just seems so grim and hopeless, especially for America. Uh, gang, by the way, all the stuff that I'm saying, it's not necessarily negative. This is the 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 empire in its last breath really kicking and screaming saying we don't want to go down and we're going to do whatever we can with the internal conflict happening right unfortunately on the sideline there are certain powers that are taking over control that aren't any better on, of, than this new empire right for certain people okay so it, it's it's not look i I know this is sounding harsh and negative. I'm saying you guys are in trouble. You guys are in trouble. You should be in trouble. When, when a family, when an individual doesn't have their uh, finances in order, when they're freaking out, when they're having a mental breakdown, you turn to them and say, look, man, you're in trouble. Okay. The first thing you need to do to improve your situation is to recognize that you are in trouble and understand why it is that you're in trouble. That way you can... Uh, not make the same mistakes again right so what all this stuff that is happening is not bad i rather this happen than what was happening during the obama administration because during the obama administration the citizens of the united states were letting their country their government kill millions of people displace tens of millions of people destroy multiple countries i mean for fuck's sakes uh why weren't people rising up where did the anti-war movement go during the obama administration i rather have this right now where people are questioning their governments where people are saying wait a second there's fraud going on irrelevant if it's happening or not right i rather have the citizens of a country hold their government in tight <laughs> I'm trying to pick the right words, right? I rather the government of a country fear its citizens than the citizens fear its government or the citizens let their government run amok, right? This is what's happening right now is a good thing because it forces citizens of the United States to have an in look internally to see what's going on right is this another color revolution that's happening in the united states yeah to a certain degree it has a signature of color revolution and what is a color revolution color revolution is the deep state the cia let's call it right going around the world starting civil wars in different countries and destabilizing those countries well guess what they're doing the same shit to your country as ron paul would say this is blowback why did people think that the CIA was going to do shit all around the world, doesn't give a rat's ass about anybody's lives, right? And you living in, in the United States, we're going to be not have to deal with this. At some point, they were going to come and do it to you, right? 